Second Life, an online virtual world created by the residents who inhabit it. It's a global 3D community filled with people, entertainment, commerce, experiences, and opportunity. It's a place that welcomes diversity and values free expression, compassion, and tolerance. Virtual environments like this offer an opportunity to use technology as a tool for addressing social needs and urging social change. A group of engineering students at the University of Michigan Dearborn are attempting to do just that with a project they are calling the Campus of Hope. Supported by a College Community Challenge Grant from the Ford Motor Company Fund, these students have purchased virtual land in Second Life and have morphed themselves into digital avatars to promote awareness about Michigan's food banks and examine some of the challenges that face them. The Campus of Hope project was one of just five projects to receive funding from the Ford College Community Challenge Program, an innovative new initiative that challenges colleges to submit proposals to Ford around the theme, Building Sustainable Communities. Colleges all across the country took part in the challenge which requires schools to come up with tangible, student-led projects that partner with community-based organizations to address critical local needs. The Campus of Hope is mirrored after the real UM Dearborn community, complete with familiar campus buildings and a replica of Ford's world headquarters. Ford has been a friend of the campus since its founding in 1959 when the company gifted 196 acres to the university to establish the Dearborn campus. The student-built Ford headquarters in Second Life is a showcase of interactive, food bank-themed games scripted by the students. For instance, guests can drive a Gleaner's food bank truck as they race against time, trying to pick up food donations before the clock runs out. Sorting donated food is not as easy as it seems when it quickly rolls off the truck. And buying a balanced, nutritious diet can be a challenge when using food stamps. Once all the games have been played, guests can run a marathon for food while earning prizes for their avatar. Or they can take a hunger ride to learn about the types of food needed most by local agencies. The goal of the project is to use Second Life to conceptualize some of the challenges facing Michigan's food banks and test possible solutions, eventually implementing those solutions in the real world in partnership with the Food Bank Council of Michigan and other local agencies. Students will continue to build upon the Campus of Hope until at least 2013 as they work to expand and strengthen the community, both in the virtual and real worlds, into a network where food banks can collaborate, exchange best practices, and access tools and resources for optimizing their operations. <laughs>